So, what's next? You know what, Goofy? I don't know. I don't know what's next. But what I do know is, welcome back to Kingdom Hearts. What is this? Three? Wow, I don't forgot. Look, oh, I'm starting a new segment today, kind of called Gaming Under the Influence. I'm not gonna tell you what influence it is because you know it's a surprise. Get enough likes, subscribes, comments. Maybe I'll reveal the influence. Maybe it'll change every time I record. I don't know. I'm just here to have a grand old time. Wow, look at that view. Oh, I wonder. Hold on. I just had the best idea of ideas. Okay, maybe not. I wanted to climb up. Okay, see, they didn't want me to be great. Like, Sora literally just jumped up this goddamn thing, and now they're telling me I can't do it? Like, what's wrong with you? Wow, fine. Anyway, like I was saying, welcome back to Kingdom Hearts um, 3. Uh, last I played, I honestly couldn't tell you what's going on. I'm just kind of here. Um, we talked to those, uh, Organization 13 peeps. <gasps> oh, but did a lot of talking and kind of ignored most of it. Uh, it's been like a week and a half. I'm so confused. We're just going to jump right in. I hope y'all have been having a, you know, great lives, you know, being successful, making good choices, staying saucy the whole nine yards. But, uh, yeah, let's, uh attempt to play this game under some unknown influence. Of course, there's a cutscene. Dis the disrespect. So, you think you can bring Roxas back? Oh. Hey, handsome! Oh. Samness! Roxas should never have existed in the first place. What you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely event you did manage to separate the two, where is it you think you can put his heart? Everywhere. Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just gonna put him back there. Do you even realize what you are saying? The other Twilight Town is just data. A heart can live anywhere, even inside data. There are hearts all around us. Hmm. Huh? Ansem and Zemnis used to be part of the same person, right? But look, now they exist separately just fine. Uh. If they can do it, then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you tell them, Captain Goofy. <laughs> In that case, by all means, nothing would please us more than Roxas's return, of course. You wish? He'll never answer to you again. Still so blind, a nobody is what's left behind. When one gives his heart to darkness, there is only one way to bring Roxas back. Which is for you to give your heart up as well. Sora, have you finally decided to call upon the darkness? <gasps> what? Go on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <gasps> now. Set your heart free. Wait! Uh, Sora! Uh. It's not darkness. Not if it helps him. Okay, but... Why are these things souped up? Can someone explain that to me? Like, this is not... This is disrespectful. Oh, okay. Just sheer disrespect. I'm still trying to figure out this whole audio thing. I'm using my Elgato game capture, and at first I was using Audacity, but that just wasn't good enough. And matter of fact, I currently have it to reduce the game sound, 
but it seems that that just like screws up the whole thing. So I'm just gonna keep that off. I can just hear it like cutting in and out, and that's annoying. Um, yeah, I was using Audacity at first, and for some odd reason, like I would press record in Audacity, and then it would start actually like recording my audio, but then actually wouldn't do a goddamn thing. And you know, here we are. And then of course it wouldn't sync up properly and I was struggling. So now I'm just going to just stick with my Elgato. If that means talking a little bit louder, then that's fine by me. Like, you gotta do what you gotta do. What the? Let's jump. Like, actual jump. Boy. Oh, bruh. That team shield bashed. Oh, he wasn't ready. He wasn't ready, boy. Stare off into the distance. He'll be fine. Herc said. <gasps> he said, with all my heart. Okay, then all my heart it is. I'm getting Roxas out. Are you though? Are you with me, Donald? Goofy? No. <laughs> you I don't know what Ansem and Xemnas want, but I think we better tell the others to watch out. Yeah! Oh, Let's head back to town. <laughs> okay, let's go head back to town. No. To be quite honest, like, I'm playing the game right now, but like... <laughs> Also, not really. Like, I'm just trying to just get through. Like, I don't know what. Like, that entire fight, like, I was not paying any attention. I was just smashing buttons, hoping for the best. Oh my god, these motherfuckers. I don't have time for this. Like, these monkeys. Like, we're not in Africa. This is not the zoo. Like, what are we doing? Beefed up, heartless everywhere. It's annoying. I pressed triangle! Why is it not working? Surprisingly, I'm doing much better than expected. Maybe? I don't know. I'm just hoping for the best. Possibly. But anyway, back to my whole audio thing. Yeah, so this stupid, dumbass Audacity software. It, like, didn't record an entire part. And so, there was 25 minutes. Like, well, however long the last part was, it was that many minutes of just silence. And like, I can't do anything with complete silence. Like, what the? What am I supposed to do with that? Oh god, a large body, little fat ass. Go get on a treadmill. Shoot. Wow, why are you aiming at this guy? Aim at the fat ass in the corner. Shoot, looking like a medicine ball. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wrong button. Oh my goodness. And then, of course, the monkey gets in my way because it's a little bitch. Hey! Take that! Bitch! It tried. I don't want to use counter shield because counter shield's kind of useless, kind of. But also. Well, a uh, correction. Counter shield is fine. Oh, shit. Counter shield is fine. It's just the whole chariot thing I could do without. Like, the chariot thing is not beneficial to me. It's just kind of there. And I don't want it. Oh, I can't do the goofy bombardier. Is there a way? I someone needs to tell me if there's a way to like change the thing. You know? Like I need to know. Cause if I can like change, <coughs> if I could. Oh shite! What the hell is this? Okay. If I was able to like change the order in which I can use those special little thingy things like I would do it what if I don't want to do splash run but I want to do uh what did I say flare force I should it should be my prerogative to do wow wow you can't combo me like that it should be my prerogative to be able to just switch my little what are things called special things right which way am I which way am I going 
Where'd I come from? Oh, there's a monkey! Kill it, Goofy! Oh, okay. See how I got under control? There's another one? Anyway, to change, like, the order in which you do the things. Have I gone up there and gotten that yet? I think I did. Okay, okay just kidding. Apparently, I haven't done it. Oh, yeah, because there was a thing. I could have sworn I did this already, Let's just in see. case. Yeah, I did do it. Then why the fu- Goofy, I could punch you in the throat. Wasting my goddamn time. But it's fine. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not fine, but, you know. We gotta do what you gotta do. Kind of. Ooh, so many items! I'm with it! Um, sorry that this part's coming out, like, super late. Whether you care or not. <laughs> I just figured I'd let y'all know. Work has been, a uh, a time. A lot of work... Uh, a lot of things that need to be accomplished, and I'm very much so the type of person where if I have shit that I need to do that's work related, like everything else is just not gonna get done unless work stuff is done. Um, so I'm just kind of been ignoring my channel, and plus since I've been having so many issues with like tech stuff, I just this wasn't I just haven't been in the mood, you know? Like there's just so many things to do and so little time and Sometimes things don't work, and you just kind of just oh wow English. You just get kind of frustrated, I guess. And so, you know, I'm just I'm just been doing my best to do what I can. Wow, my eyes are burning. <laughs> oh, I feel like I'm like two blinks away from just straight tears. Ugh. I have to use the bathroom, like, badly. And it's annoying because I felt the urge, and I was like, eh, that's fine. And I started to record the part, and it was like, great, now you really have to use the bathroom. But I'm stuck here now, because I can't pause it, because if I pause it, what the? If I pause it, all hell will break loose, and then I feel like everything's just going to, ooh, there's a thing. Yay, square moment. Anyway. Shit, what was I saying? Yeah. Oh, and then I'm gonna pause the recording and then it's just gonna throw off everything and that's gonna be sad. I'm just gonna be behind. So. Well, bless oh. my bagpipes. It was you laddies who rescued my chef. I can't go strong. Huh? Wait, didn't he sell ice cream in Hollow Bastion? That's right. But Uncle Scrooge here is what you might call a world traveler. Cool. <laughs> how are you, Uncle Scrooge? Oh, hello, Sora. You're looking hale and hearty. I heard you were on another grand adventure with these two. I hope Donald isn't making a menace of himself. Uh, why would you have to say that? So, Uncle Scrooge. What's that you were saying about a shell? Oh, right, right. The chef of me bistro here wanted to show you his appreciation. So, he baked this for you. Hmm. What is it? Your mom! Wow, the cake! Hmm? The whole cake? It's for us? Huh? I mean, uh, settle down. Uh, the chef wants you to know it's not a cake, but a tart of fruit. He does? Why keep it under my hat? May I introduce Little Chef? Oh, oh it's you! Uncle Scrooge, you won't bring the bistro and try and tell me. Hi! It all started a little while ago, when I was enjoying one of the best meals of my life. And when I asked to speak to the chef, I met this wee genius. As it turns out, he wanted to expand his culinary horizons. So I thought, that's an opportunity. And I financed the whole operation. Ooh, I think he wants to cook some more for you. Fetch some ingredients, especially anything unusual. That'll be fun. Kind of like a scavenger hunt. And the more the better. The mark of a truly great chef is creating masterpieces out of anything. 
You can start right here in town. We'll do anything to try more of Little Chef's food. <laughs> that tart short, it looks scrumptiously delicious. Okay, the ingredient hunt is on. At Little Chef's Bistro, blah, blah, blah temporary stat, green shoe gathered. Oh, God, I hated this thing. <laughs> I gotta do it again? I don't even remember what like like what, what I had to do. Did I just hit stuff. Like what the? Oh my god! Like I understand like why they do little quests like this. There we go. But like I also like why. Yeah, he does need a little more ingredients. He's a little greedy. You know what? Let me stop. Let me stop. Because one ingredient. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, cool. I figured we'd check Again, the... Little chef still needs our help. Do you think I care about Little Chef Sora? Like, I have other things to yeah. worry about. Huh. Like, entirely. Like, I'm not with the shit. I'm just not with huh. it. At all. Can I just stay on this one level instead of just, like, jumping all the way around? And just... Literally, the key to this is just to literally just hit everything. You hit everything known to mankind, you're bound to get something. Maybe. Or just get coins. Like, either way, though. Like, I'm not complaining about coins. Oh, there's an item! What's in here? Fluorite. Like, for toothpaste? What do you need toothpaste for, Sora? Like, do tell. Like, I don't imagine you- I don't remember seeing you ever brushing your teeth. Y'all are always on the run. Okay, that's nothing there. Anything here? Nope, just swinging at stuff. Cool. Oh, there's something here. Wow. Cool. Okay. There should be- There's probably something in this little square here. There we go. There's app. Wow. Cool backfit, bro. Bro, that's not what I wanted you to do. <laughs> Good for you, but this not for you. This for me. So the least y'all could do is help a sister out. Like, damn, just got me around here. Just oh my god, little chef can go find his own ingredients. Like, what I look like? I'm not the help. Jeez. Um, anything here? No. Hmm. I was already over here. Then you also, like, can't keep track of where the hell you've been. To be quite like, I feel like I've been everywhere. I haven't been over here, have I? Oh, it's me! Oh, it's Herc! Oh, that's definitely not Hercules. Who the hell is that guy? Come on! Okay. So, why are you, like, right by his dick, bro? What the hell? Okay. If you could see my face, I was genuinely in awe. And by in all, I mean absolute confusion. Like the whole meme where it's like, I'm confusion! Yeah, that that was me just now. Oh my god, if Goofy doesn't shut the fuck up, I just might slap him. <laughs> okay, let me stop. Where am I supposed to be going? Like, I literally have two more ingredients. Is there one over there? <gasps> there is one. Aha! Oh, there's one right there? Eight. Alright, come on, climb up the building, come on, come on, come on, come on! And eight! I already got that one! Oh my god. Oh my god, I've never been so pissed off in my life. Wow, can you imagine doing a victory lap? Oh, it's a lucky emblem! No. Oh, Jesus lord. Can you imagine, like, doing a victory lap, and then... The, your opponent just come up to you and is like, yeet, and just <laughs> wins the race. Like, I'd be, is that that right there? Oh. Yes! Hey, 
Trainer! Olette! Uh, hey, boss. Uh, Done with the posters. Uh -huh. Hey! Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the Bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film festival in the courtyard. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, Sora. Hold your phone up to the poster. Okay. Never! Bro, they got QR there, codes in Disney. just downloaded a promo game for the film. You can try it later. You download this Scrooge? Of course, laddie! Provide a bit of entertainment, and then give folks a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry, and eager to spend their money. Uncle <laughs> Scrooge. Gore, she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over. Oh, yeah, I'm no business guy, but I sure wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. <laughs> Dead. Seriously. <laughs> oh, right. I need to warn you guys. Why? Well, those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure. But don't we have you guys to take care of him for us? You have to leave again? Mm-hmm. It's on time. But we'll definitely be back. When are you gonna slow down? Sorry. <laughs> Just do me a favor. Well, what is it? Don't make it too tough. I know how Roxas feels to be lost. But Donald and Goofy, Kyrie, brought me back by wishing with all their hearts. Mm -hmm. So, I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. Mm. What? That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. I'm wishing. Yeah. Me and Pence, too. <laughs> Thanks. Where's Pence's fat ass, anyway? These... Maleficent? Nope. This zig bar. Aren't you making it a little too obvious? We were instructed to guide him. Yes. Just look at them. They wouldn't get far if we did not spell it out. Huh. Fair enough. But let's not forget how many times Sora still managed to rain on our parade. If he wavers from the path we lay, we destroy him. But in that case, we'll have to find ourselves another vessel. That is why we never have just one iron in the fire. Giant land. I'm okay. I'll pass. I don't care. I'll pass. <laughs> Ooh, shooting star! Double arrow guns, magic lo- Wait a second. I feel like I got this keyblade earlier than expected. The cuisine, no, 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 no. Let's equip shooting star. Uh oh. What oh, got ar Did I have any armor yet? Wow, trash. Cuisine. Sure. Wow. Alright, so let's real quick, like, do this. Get out the way. You're gonna see me struggle. Enter the bistro? Sure. I suck at this, might I add. Like, I can't crack eggs. I can't, like, cook stuff. It's just not. And then, being un- Whatever. Uh, bruh. My hand eyes just not. It's just not. Just not. It's just not there. He hasn't started? Huh? Whoa! Whoa! Hold on! Hey! I ain't got the time. Hey. Oh no! Oh! Whoa! What you? Uh, you're gonna make me cook? Mm-mm-mm. I got options. Oh, I see. 
<laughs> the dark ones. Okay, begin cooking. Use a pepper grinder to season with style. Alternate between tilting L and R just as the rings close to grind the pepper. You have limited time. Watch the hourglass. Oh god. Oh jeez. Oh sh. <laughs> Okay. Okay, I got it. It's like a tar hero. I got it. <laughs> she. Look, I said I was bad at this, and that my hand die, and that my hand die is is not that great to right now. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <gasps> That was stressful. <sighs> I literally stopped breathing for like two seconds there. Okay, what's next? Les viandes. Well, that's, this is French, so... Viands? Vienna sausages? No? Okay. What is this one? Achieve the perfect flambe. Tilt L in a circle to pour. Needs to be just the right amount. Once you think you're ready, tilt R to flambe. Sure! Oh, wait. Think of the delicious cuisine... Was imagination. When the swirls of imagination fill the screen, that's when you should tilt L. I mean R. Wow. No sooner, no later. Be very careful not to overpour. Man. Oh god. Okay, look. I don't want to burn it. Better than nothing, little rat. Shoot. Be glad that I did the thing. Gracious. Le desserts. Desert? Okay. I'm stressed. I'm doing better. Okay. Tilt L and R outwards to apply pressure. Once egg is cracked, press L1 and R1 simultaneously. This is a lot of at the same time type shit. Oh, God. Okay. Let's go. Let's just do this. First time the charm. Yeah! Excellent day! A, I might have struggled like six times on the first one, but look at that chocolate mousse! Like, psh, psh, I could be a real chef, bruh. I could be a real chef, boy. <sighs> that was still very stressful. That probably took like 20 minutes of my life, to be quite honest. I've never been so stressed my whole life. <sighs> Jesus, okay. I got it, though. I made it through. I made it through. These little fake Instagram things, they could have, they did, wow, English, they're doing too much. If you hear random words in the background, that's like me eating fruit snacks, because fruit snacks, like you gotta have sustenance, you just do. Okay, now what? Oh, follow the green arrow. Hope we find some ingredients around here. For what? Tell me, for what do you need them for, Sora? Tell me. Mmm, sure. Sure. Yep, mm-hmm, great. Great. Cool. Cool, great, uh-huh. What oh, can power up my keyblade? Wow, let's do that shit. Okay. Power up the kingdom key. And then power up the hero's origin. And then power up the shooting star. Pump, pump the jam, pump it up. Okay, let me stop. Uh, that was probably like the worst idea I could have ever did this whole entire game playthrough. Maybe. I feel like I should have probably saved all of that stuff for you know future keyblades. But you know we are here now. You like you make mistakes, and I already just saved the game, so it's there's no turning back. Time to leave this popsicle stick. Where are we going? Where should I go next? Okay, I have to get the screen loads. I'll figure it out. I'm sorry Cuts. Oh my god. By. Did Master Yensa tell you? I'm training to become a Keyblade wielder like you. That's right. No more waiting for you to come back from your adventure. Kyrie is fake. I want to get out there and do my part to help. She not ride or die. 
Merlin has used his magic to bring us to a place where time doesn't matter. Time always matters. It can take as long as we need to complete our training. Hyperbolic chamber? Amazing wizard. Or hyperbaric chamber? Oh, and by us, I mean me and Lee. He's really sorry for all the trouble he caused. I told him it's fine, but he won't stop apologizing. I'll admit I was a little scared of him at first, but I've gotten to know him better. All he ever wanted was to help his friend. Honestly, it's hard not to like him. Every now and then, I catch him staring at me. When I ask what's wrong, he says, I'm not sure. I think I'm forgetting something. I don't know what. Sora, I think it may have something to do with you. Your journey is all about helping people. Some that you've never met before. And some like Lee that you have. They're all counting on you. It won't be easy. But I hope you'll remain the happy and cheerful Sora I know. No promises. There's no heart your smile can't reach. What's wrong? Huh? Uh, nothing. Sorry. Lee. Whoa. Axel. I am. <laughs> A letter? Yep. To Sora? You jealous, bro? Technically, yes. But I won't send it. It's more for me. Ask Merlin. He'll deliver it for you. Yeah. But it's okay. I just like talking to Sora. Even if it's on paper. Q. Oh. Okay. Oh. Hmm? Here. Where in the Is hell? It? Really? Yeah. I asked Merlin to pick these up. You know. We did both summon Keyblades. Gotta celebrate. He pulled those yeah, ice pops sweetly. out his ass. And you gonna <laughs> no. eat that? What? No, uh, nothing. I just... He likes you. You're trying to remember what you forgot? No. Well, I, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So tomorrow, you and me in the ring. You ready? Of course. Don't hold back, Lee. Promise? Oh. Oh. Just waste an ice cream. Oh. Huh? Are you okay? Lee? Uh, yeah. Sorry. You're crying. What's wrong? Uh, something in my eyes. Sure. Lee. I'm gonna go. Sorry. Okay, but stop apologizing. Excuse me. Fine. On one condition. What? Call me Axel from now on. Got it memorized? Yeah. Okay, Axel. Can we talk about how he, first of all, pulled... Okay, rewind. So, they somehow managed to get a hyperbaric time chamber from DBZ Universe 1. Two, he pulled a whole ice cream cone out of his ass. She eating it, and then he just going to drop it, bro? Like, y'all don't too much. 
This guy got dreadlocks. I just can't. Where are we at? New Orleans at the world? So this is the place. Where Aqua fell into the realm of darkness after she dove in to save Terra. Yeah. She said he was acting strange. Strange how exactly? She sensed darkness in him. And they ended up getting into a big fight. Right. And in the aftermath, the two of them disappeared. Around the same time, the guards found a stranger with white hair lying unconscious here in the square. A man calling himself Xehanort. Anson the Wise took the stranger in, but that was a mistake. Xehanort betrayed his master, stole his research, and along with his fellow apprentices, separated his heart from his body. Xehanort's heart took his master's name, Ansem, and traveled to the past to give his younger self instructions. He even briefly had control of you. His empty body stayed in the present, took the name Xemnas, and founded Organization 13. Their goal was to prepare 13 vessels for Xehanort's heart. Until we put an end to the organization. But all the while, young Xehanort had been visiting the future to choose 13 vessels of his own. Hearts with strong enough ties to him to begin a new organization. The real Organization 13. And now they're looking for a fight with us. But what happened to Terra? I thought you said that Aqua saved him. Yep, she did. The problem is we didn't notice. You remember the end of the Mark of Mastery exam when Master Xehanort made his grand return? That's the Xehanort I remember. He was already a pretty old man then. But how do you explain Ansem and Xemnas, his heartless, and his nobody? Isn't it strange how young they look? Why aren't they old men? It's because Xehanort was using a different body when the split happened. That face from the portrait I mentioned? It wasn't just some stranger that Ansem the Wise took under his wing. It was the young man whose body Master Xehanort possessed. No way. That was Terra? Master Xehanort was using Terra? Yep. Master Xehanort told us another on our list belonged to him. He was talking about Terra. Turns out, Aqua saved more than just her friend that day. Okay, but Master Xehanort is an old man again now. Where did Terra's body go? Hmm. <gasps> it's cause Master Xehanort's collecting vessels. He claimed to have two of our seven lights. We got Sora back, but Terra must still be on Xehanort's side. He's with Organization 13? We should warn Sora. Yup, and Merlin too. Yeah. Pathways to new worlds are open. Wahoo! Um, batch any time. Great. 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 Cool. Wonderful. Embark. Let's go to, um, Toy Box, or we can go to Camp Man. Fine. We'll go to Toy Box. It's funny because in my previous play that I have, I went to Kingdom of Corona first. And then I went here, not realizing that I was, like, way underleveled. So, I guess we'll start here. Maybe. Sure. Honestly, no, no, no. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to start at the Kingdom of Corona, where I'm underleveled, but it's fine. So then I can start my other playthrough at the same location. Does that make sense? 
Probably makes no sense. Well, anyway, we're gonna go to the Kingdom of Corona anyway. I'm probably gonna die a lot. But, like, I'm a real OG, so... Psh, ain't nobody dying. I'm gonna make it through. It's gonna be great. I don't know what was happening to those cutscenes, because let's be honest, I wasn't paying attention. All I remember is that Mickey was like, yeah, bruh, like... What do you tell Roxas? Oh, that he was controlled for like two seconds or something dumb? I don't know. Great. We're going that way. I forgot how this thing works. Okay, there we go. Okay, you're not gonna... Okay. I don't like these. Nebula lines. In some light, race on at high speed, you can exit the other land by pressing L1 R1. Change the direction of travel? What does that mean? Great. Oh god. Woo! Boy! I ain't fighting on these motherfuckers today. What is this? Can I go through here? Wee! Wee! What is this? You will still obtain prizes or rewards exploring the ocean between. A EXP, HP, and unique items. Ah, freak! Oh, God! Jesus Christ, okay. Terrifying. Guess we can go the long way. Bitch, you're not gonna hit me from over here. Oh, shit! Okay. That's fine. Um. Um. Yeah, see, look at that. I'm too good for y'all. How do I do this thing? Oh, jeez. Okay, y'all, y'all need to chill. <sighs> Lord, the real trick is to avoid the heartless. What's that green thing over there? You know what? I don't even care. For real, it don't even matter to me. <laughs> Will let me even go in this thing? Anyway, like I said, I was not listening to those damn cutscenes because, like, I care. I've already seen them before. So, like, I don't care. And I'm probably not going to pay attention to any of the cut- Wow, this thing goes far. And I'm probably not going to pay attention to any of the cutscenes until I get to Toy Story World. Because that's where I left off originally. I got here very fast, actually. You have arrived! So, before we land in this world, I'm going to call this part finished. Because why not? I have to use the bathroom, so here we are. Um... But thanks for watching, like, comment, and subscribe, share with your friends, keep having a great day, great life, great existence, and...